All right, so my first tank just died on me, but I actually got some luck, man. Found a couple nice things. Let's check it out. No! I lost a golf ball. Dang. All right, so we're going to start things off with the best find on that dive, and that is this wallet and phone right here. This is a Samsung phone. Now, I'm not too sure what model this is right here, but I know they're waterproof. But there is water in the camera lens right here, so I'm not too sure if it's going to turn on. But the guy also has his wallet in here, like his credit card ID and uh, his debit card, I believe. So I'm actually going to be able to figure out who this belongs to. Let's go ahead and take his ID out so I can get a name. I think this wallet actually belongs to a guy I met a couple weeks ago. I told him that I actually looked for his phone and wallet for him. But um, the water got super murky, it rained, and I wasn't able to actually come out here for a couple weeks. I'm not really going to snoop. All I need to know is that his name is Alex. I'm going to give him a call real quick, tell him that I found his phone and wallet, and I'll be able to give it back to him. I'm interested in knowing if the phone works. I'm not going to snoop, but I do want to know if it still works. It's been in the river for a couple weeks. Alright, so the phone's not turning on. Uh, it just might be dead. Uh, I know these are waterproof, and it wasn't sitting too deep in the river. So he might get lucky. I don't know if he puts it in rice. <laughs> Uh, hello, is Alex there? No, this is his mom, Judy. How hey, are you? Hey, Judy, I'm doing good. I'm Jake. Uh, I found his wallet and his phone, and I was hoping I can give it back to him today. Um, I am in Maryland. Where's Alex at? He's in Mobile. He's in Mobile? Uh, yeah, what about, would Wednesday be good? Wednesday? I mean, I can do another day if, if it's better for you guys. Like, I'm, I'm, in, I'm in no rush. Like. Maybe next time he's in town, tell him to give me a ring. I live down here by the river, so I can just meet up and uh, maybe when I come okay. down here for lunch, I can hand out uh, his phone and his wallet back to him. Well, thank you. I'm so excited you found it. Oh, no worries. I found a whole bunch of sinkers on that dive. These are reusable, so we'll probably hand them out to some fishermen on the way back to the car. Check this hook out, man. This thing is huge, super rusty. Can you imagine having that in your foot? That's terrible. I found a few more hooks as well, so these are nice to get out of the river. Definitely, I don't want to step on those in the future. Didn't really find too many great fishing lures on that dive. This is probably the best one out of all of them. This rattle trap doesn't have any hooks on it anymore. Found this little grub lure. I think this is for skipjack or crappy. Found a golf ball. Actually found two, but I lost the other one. It fell down this crack. So I found this bundle of rope and fishing line. It's always nice to get this out of the river. It's super dangerous. One of the things that I really like about what it is that you do is I love the fact that you're honest, that you find stuff and you truly do try to find the owner of something and that's what I think really attracts people to your website and to your videos is that you do find really cool stuff in our place but you really do make an honest attempt to give people their GoPro back or their wallet or their phone and that's really nice in this day and age because most people be more apt to you know just to take it and I think that's one of the things that makes you you Thanks, man. You know? I appreciate that. It is, and I mean that. I mean, that's from the heart, okay? Hey, how you doing? I'm Jake. All right, man. Nice to meet you. Nice Thank to meet you. you. Well, uh, I don't know if his phone works. Hopefully, everything's oh still gosh, in there. Still looks good. But it's been a couple weeks. Probably yeah. doesn't work. It probably doesn't, but at least he has all his cards, and, that's you know, cool. he makes sure. I'll give you something for this. What? Oh, no, 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 no. You, you keep the money. I, oh, well, I'm I good. Thank you so much, so. Oh hey, I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Oh, no worries. <laughs> Tell him I said hey. Before we head out on the second dive, I wanted to let you guys know that I'm actually going back to Hawaii on the 4th through the 12th. I'm going with my buddy Brandon. I'm sure you guys have seen him in some of my videos before. But I'm also going with a girl named Lindsay. I actually met Lindsay about a month and a half to two months ago here on this island. Now I'm sure you guys have already seen Brandon in some of my videos, but you've never seen Lindsay. I've actually never showed you guys any girls ever on my YouTube channel that I'm like interested in. And I think she's honestly a really cool girl. She's beautiful, smart, and brave. And I'm actually really excited to get to know her a little bit more. So I invited her to come out to Hawaii with us to have a good time. I actually invited Lindsay to come down here and scuba dive for her very first time. She's actually never even swam in a river. So <laughs> we're going to the advanced level here like immediately. But I think she'll have a lot of fun. If you guys want to help me win some extra points with Lindsay, head over to her Instagram account, give her a follow, and leave her a nice comment or two on some of her photos. I'll put a link in the description below. But I know if you guys flood her Instagram account with nice comments, it would definitely make her day and I'm pretty sure I'll win some extra points. So help me out, man. I'm gonna formally introduce you guys to Lindsay in the future. I'm sure she's gonna be in a lot of videos of mine, but uh, today we're just gonna get out there, scuba dive for her very first time, and just have a good time here at the river.
our first tank, we found a handful of really nice things, but on our second tank, we're actually gonna dive down the river a little bit, see if we can get lucky down here. On the second dive, I found so much stuff. There was like one moment where I was holding two anchors, a knife, and like some pliers, and I was like dropping stuff, but I tried my very best to grab everything I could. Nope. I'm gonna go ahead and start off with my favorite find of that dive. It is this anchor. I found like two or three of these before, and this is a really good one. I actually don't have one for my kayak, so I can actually use this for my kayak. That's cool. All this stuff was so heavy, I actually had to leave the second anchor on the steps, but I wrapped up the rope, I left it there so someone else could use it. I didn't really want to throw it away because it was a perfectly good anchor, so I just wrapped it up, put it up on the steps, and I'm sure someone's gonna grab it. Uh, the weirdest find of that dive has to be the Xbox 360 headset. I found a cool knife, but I lost it. Found these pair of pliers, they're really rusty. So I'll probably just throw this away. Now these are the weirdest sunglasses I've ever found in my entire life. I saved these for a reason. <laughs> I probably look so stupid. <laughs> I can't see anything. There's so much river slime in there. I found a couple pink lures. Like, look at these. I've actually used these pink flukes before, but uh, I haven't had too much luck with them. Found a spinnerbait again with a fluke on it. This is my second one so far, I like that. <laughs> you guys, check these out. Found some beads. I found a lot of weights and fishing lures, but a lot of these are just too far gone. What's that? You're Dale MD. Dale MD. Yeah, that's me. How you doing? Thanks, man. I appreciate that. <laughs> you Dale MD. <laughs> I like that. If you guys didn't know, it's the Almighty, and it sounds like you're saying the Almighty when you say it, like Bruce Almighty. I sh probably should have picked an easier YouTube name, but Dale MD, man. That's me. <laughs>